Things are escalating day on day in the run-up to poll-bound West Bengal. Politics before the Bengal elections is truly just heating up before people's eyes with each passing day. Bengal BJP chief Dilip Ghosh's Facebook post seeking revenge after yesterday's attack on the BJP chief's convoy has sparked controversy. Taking a dig at Mamta's pre-2011 slogan, we want change, not revenge, Dilip Ghosh in his post says that change will happen and so will revenge in 2021. The politics of Badla, basically. He's attacked the Trinamool and said they, can't, they can beat us as much as they want, but they must remember that they will get it back with interest in the future. Another Bengal BJP leader, Sayantan Basu, has also issued a threat reminding the Trinamool of a dialogue from the Shole film. He says that if you kill one of us, we will kill four of yours. So a lot of murderous threats and rhetoric is now being mainstreamed in the political battleground of West Bengal. सवाल ये नहीं है सवाल गलती कोई भी करे गलती हो सकती प्रति गलती को सरक्षण प्रदेश का मुखिया दे तो ये चिंता की बात है और कोई बात नहीं कल अगर घटना हो गई टीएमसी के लोगों ने अगर पथराव कर दिया तो मुख्यमंत्री को अपने बड़प्पन का ध्यान रखते हुए उन कर कार्यकर्ताओं की निंदा करना चाहिए थी पर उल्टा उन्होंने नड्डा जी के ऊपर आरोप लगा दिया और जिस शब्दों का जिस दरिद्र भाषा का उपयोग किया गया मैं समझता हूँ बहुत शर्मनाक है और किसी मुख्यमंत्री से हम ऐसी अपेक्षा नहीं करते आज के बीजेपी जेपी नड्डा इसे डायमंड हार्बर के गड्ढा ही पड़ी तो हमें कि करते साधारण मानुषर क्षोभ बहिप्रकाश दायित्व तो हमार न लकडाउन समय मानुषर खोज नी आप कखो जी एस टी कख नोटबंदी कख एकाधिक जनबिरोधी प्रकल्पगुल मानुषर जीवन दिन पर दिन अपना अंधकार नहीं एक दिन खोज नी कटा कबार अमित शाह इसे लकडाउन अपना बोलू ना देखिए ये शब्दावली जो ममता जी की है ये उनके संस्कारों के बारे में बताता है दिस स्पीक्स वॉल्यूम्स अबाउट हर पर्सनैलिटी अबाउट हर कल्चर अबाउट द ट्रेडिशन इन विच शी इज ब्रॉट अप सो शी हैज टू आंसर दैट क्वेश्चन बदला शुरू हो जाो कल लागिए सामान्य उदाहरण एक सोलह सिनेमार डायलग शुने एक मारोगे तो हम चार मारेंगे बीजेपी चाहले तृणमूल कॉग्रेस नेता दे पश्चिम बंगे बहरे बड़नो बंद कर दीते क्यों बेरोधे बाढ़ बना सब एक हानी इधर एक मोतो गौरतलब लुकी है था ये बहुत ही अनफॉर्च्युनेट है लेकिन अगर हमलोग को कोई मारने आएगा तो बदला के बदले में तो बदला ही होगा अगर कोई मारेगा तो उसके बदले में हमलोग भी मारेंगे ये कोई भी हो कल डायमंड हार्बर में आप लोग देखे हैं कि क्या क्या माने अवस्था में और कितना नीचा उतर के माननीय मुख्यमंत्री ये कर रहे हैं हम लोग भी ताज्जुब बन गए कि नेशनल प्रेसिडेंट को भी वो नहीं छोड़ेंगे अप्स बाय वायलेंस एंड द रेजोनेंस ऑफ दैट इज गोइंग टू बी फेल्ट फॉर अ वेरी लॉन्ग टाइम आफ्टर बीजेपी प्रेसिडेंट जेपी नड्डा एंड बंगाल इंचार्ज कैलाश विजयवर्गीयस कॉन्वॉयस वर वायलेंटली अटैक्ड येस्टरडे इन साउथ 24 परगनास द होम मिनिस्ट्री अंडर अमित शाह हैज समंड द वेस्ट बंगाल पुलिस चीफ and the chief secretary to appear before him on monday governor jagdeep dhankar has also submitted his report to the ministry of home affairs sources say that the governor has told the center that there wasn't adequate security arrangements for the convoy he's also claimed that security protocols weren't followed despite prior information of jp nadda's visit prime minister modi spoke to the bjp chief and also to kailash vijayvargya to inquire about their well being kailash vijayvargya had claimed to have been injured in a minor way furious over the attack against their leaders bjp workers in several parts of india have taken to the streets to protest meanwhile a month after his bengal outreach home minister amit shah will be visiting the state again on the 19th and 20th of december has mamta ji become so desperate we are proud of our democracy you can differ but this has rarely been heard to the all india president of the ruling party who is ruling the country and so many states has to suffer these kinds of violent attacks he was saved by providence other senior friends like kalashudjevargian many others including media people did suffer maybe his 
बुलेट प्रूफ कार सेव डिम देर फॉर डज इट शो द शेयर डेस्परेशन ऑफ ममता जी इफ दैट द केस देन आई विल ओनली टेल यू आई स्टिल बिलीव दैट यू फॉट द वायलेंस ऑफ द लेफ्ट टू कम टू पावर इफ यू आर एक्सीडिंग देयर वायलेंस you will fend you will suffer from the people in a much strident manner what the left suffered violation of the constitution this is without jurisdiction this is colorable exercise of power this is a colorable exercise of power and behind entire thing there is a malice there is a malice on the part of the central government and there is a malafide attitude on the part of the central government officers by sending this letter this is deplorable one can deplore one can just deprecate it the way the things are doing by the central government okay west bengal governor jagdeep dhankar has blasted mamta banerji in a fashion that he has become accustomed to doing over the attack on the bjp president jp nadda's convoy yesterday he held a press conference today and said that the attack signals the death of democracy in bengal he appealed to the mamta banerji government and to the chief minister herself to apologize for her remarks on jp nadda calling her observation unfortunate she had basically said that the attack yesterday on the bjp chief was tamasha or notanki well the governor further added that if the chief minister of bengal diverts from the constitution then he will always intervene governor dhankar also slammed mamta on her outsider comment he said that calling citizens of india outsiders is playing with fire meanwhile trinamool mp mahua maitra has called dhankar bjp's unelected hatchet man masquerading as a governor 